Do you think that President Paris's uh, meeting yesterday with President Mahmoud Abbas or other little hints are opportunities? And is this just a bump in the road or have we reached really rock bottom? I think that Israel has to make a decision which it didn't make. I think the government has to decide what it wants. What is the goal? Not that we can fight, we can, but for what end? Suppose the Arabs come to us and say, all right, we want an agreement. Which is it? What is the border you want? Did we decide? No. I think we need to set a goal. The goal is to get the borders of Israel expanded by the blocks, not more than that. And then to state a policy. We don't build anything on the other side of the blocks. We do build in the blocks. It will make it coherent and, I think, legitimate in the eyes of the world. We need to stop uh, occupy as much as we can the part that we don't need. We can't get the army out. We wouldn't get the army out without an agreement. We saw Gaza enough for once. But we can indicate by action in Area C, in police work, in every other thing that you mean to get out. And if they agree, let them have a state. If not, we do our part. It will change the pressure in the world, it will change the way the world looks at us. It will be good for us because the danger of one state in the end is really a great danger for the Zionist enterprise. And we need to start working in that direction.